What's up everybody, Peter Eichmann's here showing off the UDRAW game tablet from THQ today. Uh, the game tablet is now available for Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3, whereas it came out one year ago for the Wii, though there's now a new version for Wii available that also comes in black. Uh, the tablet comes in at $80, which includes UDRAW Studio Instant Artist. Um, but yeah, let's show you a little bit about how the tablet works by diving right into UDRAW Studio, um, which provides actually some handy little art lessons for amateurs such as myself and uh, open canvases for those who may be better than myself, which is basically everybody. It does a pretty good job of one-to-one -one correlation with what I'm drawing on the pad and what you see on the screen. And uh, before we bore you guys too much, um, you can see it's just following the pen where I go. There's a slight lag which shows up more when you're shading things in, but rather than bore you with the entire 17 steps of this lesson, we're just gonna fast forward ahead at this point. That's not the most complex of lessons, but it does, it works great, you know, for kids. When we're talking about learning about complementary colors and how to draw the eye to different aspects of the painting. There's definitely some more complicated lessons that dig into landscapes and some other elements along those lines, but you know, it's a good jumping off point if you wanna teach kids, you know, the differences between warm and cool colors, how to draw circles, uh, sketching tomatoes you can see, gestures, learning to use grids, and they'll even dig into things like the rule of thirds. And on the other end of the spectrum, the UDRAW tablet also controls games like Marvel Super Hero Squad Comic Combat, where I'm using the cursor to point around the game world, indicate who I want to attack, using my tiny team of Marvel superheroes. Um, so you can also draw shapes into the game world to create bombs, or if I make a triangle, you can create decoys, so which hopefully the enemies will think are me instead of the actual me, and just by tapping at different areas on the tablet, move around the world. One of the cooler elements is actually, if you click on one of your characters and drag a path, Thor is now going to throw his hammer in the path I just drew, which helps with different shielded enemies and different ways to work around the game world, much like this guy down here. I can't attack him directly because of his shield, but by boomeranging around the back, I can attack him that way. Uh, it's a cool little game and a far cry from the more artistic and open-ended nature of the studio game, but overall the tablet's responsive, clean, cool, and a nice little device from THQ. For more on the UDRAW game tablet, check out IGN.com.